Hi, I just want to take you through a, a marketing email that I got from one of the big name online marketing gurus. Um, doesn't really matter who it comes from because bottom line is these guys are all getting us to buy their courses and their books and to go on their seminars using the same kind of techniques and if you've been following me recently you'll know that I'm going at, I'm really wanting to take internet marketing in a very different direction with my open source marketing project uh, which is you know a massive it's a life's work it's and it's going to it's going to evolve it's going to run over the next few years next few decades who knows where it's going to go but just in order to help you understand the difference between what, what the the type of internet marketing that that I don't want to see anymore I don't want to do anymore and true marketing when you're actually helping people to get something they really want so I want to walk you through this um, we're gonna do it line by line just just so that you can start to 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 notice the difference between truth and truthfulness versus this um, untruth that we see in in so much online marketing now and the bottom line is really that what these guys what these guys do is they sell their own stuff right and they it, it, it doesn't serve them to write the definitive guide to to marketing and to teach you how to do marketing the right way they, they need you to keep buying off them so they want you to be hooked they're like more like drug dealers now they don't actually want to educate you they want to say here's a new trick here's something else here's a new cheat I found and you need to keep coming back to to me in order to get the next one so let's work through this email and just just in a few minutes and I'll show you try to show you exactly how they're doing it so here we go this is the email it comes uh, coming from the digital marketer brand which is Ryan Dice's brand and it starts with a bold headline which is obviously designed to catch your attention right so what we're gonna see here is gonna see a lot of techniques that we should be using combined with some techniques that are manipulative or untruthful in a subtle way and I'd, I'd like to try and tease apart the difference okay so headlines should catch your attention headlines should draw your attention to the key fact now this one says split test results great top funnel copy change lifted engagement by 15.2 percent right now if you if we pick this apart we'll notice that what it may be suggesting to you is not actually what it's um, going to deliver so top funnel copy change right copy change is great lifted engagement by 15.2 percent right now you need to know that engagement is not necessarily the same as sales it's not necessarily the same as turnover or profit right engagement literally means it might mean how many people click the thing now anybody can create a single change of 15.2 percent in something right and and particularly if you take something that was crap to start with uh, and change it to something that's okay you'll get a 15.2 percent lift okay so this this is not it's it's suggesting that there's something really useful here and but it may not be really useful I know I've been doing this kind of conversion work for, for several years we we increase clicks by 15.2 percent at a 95 percent confidence rate 95 percent confidence rate by the way is not something you can take to the bank either normally I'll, I'll wait for a 98 99 percent confidence rate so let's carry on this there's not much more copy to work through you're gonna love the little trick we're sharing on the digital marketer blog today now interestingly they have this is pretty much all the copy they have multiple links that you can click on to the same thing the links are blue they're underlined they stand out okay good principle this is good usability they want to give you multiple opportunities to click if you're going to send people an email and you want them to click through to something don't just put the link once if you really want them to do it okay 
It increased clicks on a critical call to action by more than 15%. Okay, so now we understand what they mean by engagement. So just let's back up. You're going to love, okay? You're going to love is presumptive language, and that's it's kind of fair enough. If they're actually going to deliver something good, it's fair enough. Now here's the little trick, right? These guys deal in little tricks. They want you to believe that they have special insight, the magic beans, right? And trick means something for nothing. Trick means shortcut, back door, right? It means it's going to be easy if you know how. And it's suggesting that they know how. That we're sharing on the blog today. Um, may, may have been today. I haven't looked at the page. I don't know. It's a big win. Okay, so here's the thing, right? What 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 are they selling? They're selling money for nothing. You buy my stuff and I'm going to show you how to get more money easily. And sometimes that can be done, right? Doing marketing the right way is an incredibly effective way to increase your turnover and increase your profits. So he's promising big win on one hand and super easy for you to implement or test on your site on the other hand. Okay. So big win, super easy for you to implement. He's also using that magic word you. Okay. Starts the email with you're going to love and then says easy for you to implement. So what this is saying is yes, you can. Yes, you can use this. This is accessible to you. Good marketing. Okay, so big win and super easy. That's what you want. You want people to, to start to warm up to the fact that and get excited that there's going to be something um, easy that's gu guaranteed to deliver results for you if you're uh, on the inside. But here's the biggie. So not only is it a big win and super easy. When we were looking at the test results, we discovered something much more valuable as a second link. You've got to check this out, right? So what this is, is a complete tease. We don't know what the much more valuable thing is. Um, we discovered it. So it, what are they saying? They're saying this is new. This is an insight, right? If you actually look at what, what we've been given here, there's, he's not actually saying that there's anything with any substance whatsoever. When we were looking at the test results, we discovered something much more valuable. You've got to check this out, right? So what's he done? He's whetted your appetite with basically free money, right? Big win, super easy. But there's something even better. But I'm not going to tell you what it is because you have to click through and do it. It's a fantastic example of the kind of money you find laying on the table when you do a little testing. Right now, Ryan's been selling the benefits of split testing for years. If uh, I, I did another article when I um, dissected something else that, that Ryan put out a little while ago, I'll, I'll add a link to that. Um, money lying on the table. Okay, what are we talking about? Again, it's free money. Right now, here's here's the fact. You you can take something bad and make it okay, and then say that that's an example of easy money, funding money laying on the table, you know, 15.2% boost, right? Anybody can do that with pretty much any site. But what these guys are saying is, we're expert marketers, but there's a biggie here. We were amazed when we discovered something much more valuable. I, don't, I just don't believe it. Then finally, again, another call to action. Read today's article. So it's saying this is current. This is now. Right? This is live now uh, to see our results. And then click through. So uh, w what I want you to, to see is the, the effort that's being put into suggesting that there's something exciting, easy, valuable. A backdoor, a cheat. Right? But in reality... Ryan hasn't told you anything. Now, it may be that what Ryan has got is a genuine insight. If so, it is very, very likely that what he's going to tell you is just normal marketing done well. 
right? But he's selling it to you in a way that suggests that this is a brand new realization and it's going to make you easy money. So my advice is just tread carefully. Whenever you get an email like this, look at what's actually being said. Look to see if there's any substance there whatsoever. And if all they're selling you is excitement to get your juices flowing, to get your emotions going, and then asking you for money for something else, just be careful. Thanks for your time.